Hi, today what we're going to do is take a look at how you can assess your own wrist mobility um, if you're having some issues with either the front squat or the clean. Um, one of the main limitations that I hear or one of the main complaints I hear with people who are doing either the clean or the front squat is either wrist pain or feeling like the wrist is about to explode with the, with the catching of the clean. So majority of the pain is at the wrist, but it's not always coming from the wrist. It could be something up the chain as far as the elbow, the shoulder, or even some thoracic mobility can be causing the limitations. Um, a quick screen for the wrist to just see whether that's the issue is you're looking for about 90 degrees of wrist extension. Um, if you have about 90 degrees, you should have sufficient mobility for performing both of those movements. So, a quick one is a prayer stretch. So you're just taking the hands, making sure you're keeping the bottom of the hands together, pushing down and seeing whether you're able to get to that 90 degree, 90 degrees of motion there. Now you can also do this in weight bearing in a weight bearing position since with the bar that you're gonna have some weight on top of you, you can get down into a quadruped position. And you're just doing a forward rocking or forward lean. So again, keeping the hands flat on the ground, you are going to lean forward, trying to see whether you can get your forearm perpendicular to the ground. If you're able to get into that position and you're still having pain in the wrist with the movements, uh, like I said, with the clean or the front squat, maybe check up the chain as far as the elbow, shoulder, or the thoracic spine. But if you're able to get in that position, you should be clear to the wrist. Thanks.